Let's take a break from the world and doodle a school of fish. This is a fun, fast, easy drawing. And as you can see, we're just gonna draw these what look like leaves. If you didn't know we were doing fish, you might think we were about to do some cascading leaves. Um, I always like to put a border on my paper just because I don't like the feeling of my pen running off the edge. So put a little border there. It kind of frames it nicely when we're all done. After you've put your uh, bodies of your fish, now all you have to do is go back and draw a head on them, just a little curved line and an eyeball. In retrospect, I wish I'd made my eyeballs a little bigger. You can't really tell what direction most of those fish are looking, and it's kind of fun to make some of them look behind. They look a little nervous, like they're being followed, and some are looking up and down to make sure their friends are close by. And now we have a bunch of fish. Um, I put a few fins on them just for fun to add a little something and now it's all on you to decide how do you want to decorate your fish. The uh, scallop pattern is kind of my primary scale pattern so I kept it going throughout and then I just had fun with dots and lines in different forms. Once I got this done I really thought it'd be fun to do on a smaller scale on some sort of a greeting card. We need a clever fish saying to go with it. And you can tell I just have maybe five or six patterns that I just repeat throughout. It doesn't have to be anything fancy. If you only want to do one or two, you can. Um, if you want to do every single fish differently, that would be fun too. And usually when I get finished doing a line drawing like this, it kind of, even though it's fun, it looks a little flat. So we'll do a, add a few details to make these fish really stand out on their own and give a little depth to our doodle picture. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to pick some of these fish and let them have these nice black faces. If you're enjoying this video, would you take a second and click that like button so YouTube will know and that way they'll share this video with more people. Thanks so much. And then we're going to go in and we're going to add a thicker pen outline so you can distinguish one fish from another a little easier. And you can just see just from the part I've done and the part I haven't done um, that it really is an improvement to the overall picture. You know, I also thought this would make a great coloring page, but I resisted and did not add color to this one. And there you have it, a school of fish, a great way to set aside your thoughts for the day for a few minutes and have a little bit of fun. Now, I think you'd like this video on the left or this playlist on the right. I thank you so much for joining me today.